Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. Today I'm going to explain the two different water filters that Keurig makes for their Keurig machines. So one is considered kind of an older water filter, and then there's a newer water filter. So I've got some examples of some newer Keurigs, and i got some examples of some older Keurigs. So here's what the two different water filters look like. They're not interchangeable. So this is considered kind of the older one for the older Keurigs, and this is the newer one. The newer one comes in two sizes. They call it a short handle and a tall handle. This is the tall handle and the short handle is not very big at all. Now the good thing is both of them take the exact same water, the actual filter. This is a carbon filter and this is a carbon filter. So this one takes exactly the same one as this one. It's just the holder that you use to put it in the tank is different. Okay, so I've got a K Supreme Plus Smart coffee maker. Let's take a look at the tank. I've got this K Express. We'll grab its tank. Now, this is the K Classic. And the reason I got two K Classics, one is older, one is newer. This one takes the newer filter. This one takes the older filter. And then this is kind of an older one too. So let's grab all these tanks. So the first thing you're gonna wanna look for is this, where the water comes out of the tank at the bottom. That's what this is going to snap onto. This, this is considered the newer style. See how it's really small, really small. Then we get into this style here. This is considered the older style. These two tanks have this and they take this type of water filter. Okay, so let's demonstrate. We're gonna take this tall handle and it'll just, it has to snap on. You have to snap it on. So see if I try to lift that, it's gonna lift the whole tank. If you don't snap it onto that bottom thing, they will float and then you just pull them off. They're not snapped on real hard. Now let's look at this one. So same thing here. We've got to snap this on to that. Now you'll hear a definite snap and when you try to lift it up, it won't come up. If you don't snap them on, they will float and then the water won't go through the filter to get to the machine. And then you just pull it off. But these, unfortunately, these are not interchangeable. This one will not fit on this one. You can tell right away, it's just not, you know, you may think it's on there, but it's gonna float off. And same, see th these tanks are both from a K Classic. This is a newer one. So the newer one has that little black disc that this will snap onto. Whereas this, you, again, you may think it's on there, but it's, it'll float. So you have to get that snap action. And we can see that the depth of these is a lot different. This one's not as deep. But the good thing is, if so if you've got some filters, like again, the carbon filter is exactly the same that fits inside both of them. And then there's just these little uh, things on the side. You just, this thing comes apart. The filter just kind of sits in there. It's rounded on one side and flat, you just push it in there like that, and then this will snap on, and same with this. Um, you, wanna, you wanna soak these in water for 10 minutes because there's a bunch of carbon dust in here that's gonna come out. So you're gonna soak this in a cup of, a cup of water. The water's gonna turn really dark gray. After 10 minutes, you're gonna rinse this under water. Then the water filter is ready to install. Now, some of these generic ones this is a dial. This is to tell you what month. See, it says replacement due. So you're supposed to change these every two months. So right now, I would turn it to two months past today's date. So right now, it's, it's August. So 10, 11, November, I need to change this carbon filter. So these generic ones are kind of nice. And same with these. You might find a generic one. It'll have a round dial up here with another set of dates that you kind of know when to change it. Those are good reminders. So again, what you're looking for is that, that black disc. It's really small compared to this one. And again, this one will go with this one. And then they call these the tall and the short handles, depending on what kind of tank you've got. Some Keurigs have got really short tanks. Then you got to use a short handle. So these are really tall tanks. And that's why you got to have the, the tall handle. Check out my videos. I've got a video on how to change the water filter on, on all the current model Keurigs. 
I'll put a link to the, both of these filters in the show description notes, along with replacement carbon filters. If you do click on the link, I get a little bit of money from the clicks. I am an Amazon affiliate. The products don't cost you anymore, but it is a way of supporting my channel. I do buy all my own products with my own money. Thanks everybody for watching. And if you could, please like and subscribe.